Hello, my name is Jennifer Rice Sherrill and I'm going to be presenting a session as part of the stage events as one of their chosen experts. The session is called Graduate Essentials, How to Launch Your Career. Um, I was once a graduate like you. I graduated from Mountview Academy in musical theatre and did a showcase at the Criterion. Since then I've been gathering lots of different forming experiences of different types. I then wrote a book about trying to break into the industry and all the ups and downs and tips and tricks you need to deal with. I've since then become a theatre critic, a writer, and most importantly I review um, student showcases now for the stage, which gives me sort of unique perspective um, and listening ear between graduates and the industry, agents and casting directors and everybody related to actually giving you a job, which is the most important thing. Um, so yes, my session will benefit graduates because it sums up everything that I've learned from reviewing, being a performer and being a writer, which gives them a unique perspective. I think the main challenge people face is just the, the sheer number of graduates um, that are now coming out. I mean, there's something like a thousand new graduates each year from accredited drama schools and university related courses. So, you know, back in the day, casting directors and agents sort of had a general overview of who was in the profession or about to enter. Now that's just impossible because there's so many. So they people have to sort of make a, a real stand about entering the industry, know who they are, know their niche, um, know why they should be chosen rather than you know, 10 people who are similar to them. And it's just sort of even more banging on doors and I think more precise banging on doors than it used to be. Again, another problem that graduates have is they leave and they suddenly get confronted with a lot of rejection and obviously that is emotionally stressful, dealing with a rejection on a daily basis and keeping your self-belief uh, and belief in the industry. Um, and the main question being, how can anyone give you a job if you don't believe in yourself? And I think the main thing to think about is, it is a very uncontrollable profession and most of the time you're not being rejected because it's about you, but because of a specific brief or timing issues, budget issues, or maybe just simply because you've been overlooked because there's been 200 or 300 other submissions they've had to deal with that day. Um, and I think it's keeping a perspective and keeping a life outside of all of that as well and sort of taking it for what it is and keeping focused, but not letting it overrule your life. I think I have quite a unique insight because first of all I come from a performing background and I still sometimes perform now um, so I know what it's like and I've done the showcases obviously myself as in I did a showcase with Mountview at the Criterion Theatre which is where most of the showcases now take place um, and now I'm reviewing them so I'm kind of in the middle of the graduates and having the stage experience as well as talking to industry experts after and before the showcases and generally to find out what they thought of the showcases, how it measures up, you know, in terms of what the industry needs and what graduates can do to take that leap from being a student to being a professional. So I'm kind of the, the middle ear between everybody um, and sort of crossing boundaries and trying to communicate what maybe otherwise would be missed. Um, I think the main thing that graduates need to think about is that you are your own business and as much as you can, you know, in inverted commas, rely on, say, an agent putting you up for work or, you know, once you're in a show, you're in that show and you have a job for a year and, and it sort of feels safe, you're constantly redeveloping and creating, learning um, and changing yourself. And I think as you're starting on that road, you'll be asking yourself questions like, you know, what, what can I offer? Who am I? Why am I different? What is my casting niche? What are my strengths? What are my weaknesses? What do I need to work on? And also, have you done enough research about the professional world? Why are you still sort of in that drama school zone of, you know, the student zone? Sort of, I'll see what happens. Um, because it is all about being proactive and thinking about what can make you stand out. As much as it is about being realistic, um, I think it's also about having faith and sort of exuding that positivity because the industry does want to work with positive people who believe in themselves. So it's a combination of all that. 
My session is called um, Graduate Essentials, How to Launch Your Career. And it covers five main bits. The first one being, what are you selling? Which is basically um, finding your own niche in casting and in the performing arts world generally. And then we've got a section on agents, which is all about uh, the agent's role and also the actor's role, um, how to submit to agents in terms of letter writing and how to handle working with an agent once you've actually signed. The third part uh, relates to castings, which again um, is about letter writing and things like uh, do's and don'ts, preparing for and behaving in professional audition and casting. And also, I'll be mentioning sort of general photo and CVs, do's and don'ts, um, things that people worry about there, choosing a photographer. The fourth bit will be about uh, jobs, so keeping yourself afloat financially while you're not acting, or possibly even while you're acting. So the different types of temp jobs, uh, pros and cons, how to get them, um, including corporate role play, and also juggling working for free with your non-acting bill paying job. Part five will cover finances, which uh, is mainly to do with trying to budget everything, which can be really hard because you don't know when you're gonna get paid and also your pay varies from month to month, so that's quite a tricky one. So I'll be concentrating on how to handle that and also how to deal with taxes, which is a whole different ball game if you're self-employed. Um, and give you some tips on how to save money generally and if you're located in London. Join me, Jennifer Reichel, for my event aimed at graduates, which is called Graduate Essentials, How to Launch Your Career. And it will take place on the 21st of June at 10.30, three hour session hosted at the Darfont Room in the Prince of Wales Theatre in London.